Hello everybody, today we're going to start our ladder letter handwriting family with the letter I, which makes the I sound. Now remember for these sessions you will need plain paper or a whiteboard as well as lined paper. You'll also need a handwriting pen or a nice sharp pencil. Right, let's get started then. So to write the letter I, we start where the line would be and we go up, down and hook, then dot. So let's have a go at writing six letter I's. Start on the dot, up, down, hook, then dot. On the dot, up the ladder, down the ladder, hook, and dot. On the dot, up, down, hook, and dot. I would like you to do six of these. So start on the dot, up, down, hook, and dot. Now choose your neatest letter I and give that a tick. And if you're happy with your letter I's, you're now ready to go on to stage two. So let's start with some common mistakes. The first one is making the eye too big, too high in the sky. Remember that the main body of your letter I should be only as high as the letter A or the letter C. And so your dot shouldn't be too high in the sky either. Also be careful not to do a big football on top of your letter I or a scribble or a circular scribble. All you need to do is put a nice simple dot at the top here. Let's have a practice of writing some letter I's on line paper. So start on line, up, down, hook and dot. Up, down, hook and dot. Have a go at doing six of these, making sure your dot isn't too high in the sky and it isn't too big like a big football. Once you've done six of these, tick the one that you think is the neatest. Let's have a go at joining our letter I then. So, we start in line, we go up, down, hook into our next letter, up, down, hook into our next letter. And we don't put the dots on the I's until we finish the word. So I'd like you to do six sets of three, putting your dots after you've finished your three main bodies of your eyes. So up, down, hook, up, down, hook, up, down, hook, dot, dot, dot. Remember not to scribble for your dot. Remember not to draw a big football. Remember not to do your eye too high. Just simple dots on the top of your letter eyes. If you're happy with your six sets of letter I's, tick your favourite. Which one is the neatest? So I'm going to tick these three letter I's because the dots are all the same height and they look neat. And I've realised I've forgotten to tick my my eye from the previous um, stage. So I'm going to tick that letter I that looks the neatest to me. Right, for stage four then, we're going to write a sentence I like it. So starting with my capital letter, and as I write like, I'm going to go up high for the letter L, then hook into my letter I, and then into my letter K, and then into my letter E, and then I'll go back and put the dot on my word like. So make sure that you don't put the dot on your letter I's until you finish the word. Now stage four is all about experimenting with the style of handwriting, with our style and I'm going to write the next sentence a bit smaller because I know that writing smaller often makes our handwriting look neater. And don't go too small and make sure it's big enough to read. I could just try writing a little bit smaller and seeing if it looks neat. So start with my capital letter then into my like, not taking my pen off until I finish the word and then I go back and put the dot. I like it. 
Right, so I'm going to have a go at writing this sentence with a slant. So I'm turning my page to get more of an angle on the line and this will help me ensure that all the letters are slanting the same amount. Remember that it's important that they all lean the same amount. So I like it. There we go. I'm going to have another go now, maybe a bit smaller. Um, so starting my capital letter making sure those letters are leaning forwards the same amount. And don't forget to put the dots on your eyes and then have a look at your four sentences and choose the sentence which you're happiest with. Which style do you think looks the neatest? I prefer my fourth sentence. I'm going to tick this one. And then looking for my favourite I, my neatest letter I, I'm going to go for this one as well. There we go. So once you've ticked your favourite sentence and your favourite letter I, that's it. You've finished stage four. Well done, everybody. That was the letter I. In our next session, we'll practice the letter J and continue with our ladder letter handwriting family. Well done. See you later then. Bye bye.